Well, hello folks, this is Jamil Swift for Gunstruck Reviews. I'm here at C2 Tactical in Scottsdale, Arizona, the indoor range. We're gonna do a little intro and a little how-to on the new Taurus TX-22 22 long rifle pistol. This just came out this year. It's a very lightweight, easy, and f easy to use and fun little pistol for plinking and just having fun shooting cans in your, in your local range. Um, is of course very lightweight, it's a polymer frame with a 10 round magazine that comes with it. And we're gonna, we're just gonna go a little overall on the features, a nice trigger on it, very good trigger pull. It's very, very lightweight with adjustable rear sights for elevation and windage, of course. And it has a nice front sight with a white dot. And it is in general, a very, very good pistol for just having fun with it. One little feature, of course, has thumb safeties for those who actually need a thumb safety or want one. You don't have to use it if you don't want to. And we're gonna go ahead and do a little, uh, before we go take it out to the range, this thing has a feature that I really like. It has an adapter for a threaded, for a threaded adapter half by 28. So basically you can actually put a suppressor on it. So the first things, first things first, we're just gonna make sure the pistol is clear. There's nothing on the chamber. We're gonna remove the original thread protector that comes with the pistol. I'm just gonna go ahead and remove it. This thing has, if you, I'm gonna show you here, if you notice the thread protector has four flats in it that would allow you to use a small crescent wrench or adjustable wrench just in case your adapter doesn't come off as easily as mine did. The next step, we're just gonna go ahead and clean the threads on the barrel just to make sure there's no residue because we're going to put the thread adapter onto it. Now that it's nice and clean, we're gonna put our thread adapter on. And we are not going to thread lock it yet. We're gonna make sure that everything is okay before we use any thread locker on it. Now, this allows us to use a suppressor, this being a silencer core suppressor. Check it out. Now we're gonna to go to the range and do some shooting with it, with and without the suppressor, so you can see the difference. Stay tuned for more for Gunstock Reviews. Thank you for watching Gunstock Reviews. Please visit our website at www.gunstockreviews.com for more exclusive content please visit our Patreon page at www.patreon.com slash gunstockreviews. Your contributions would be greatly appreciated and help us grow our selections and frequency of videos.